I really like that red tree. It would be nice to have a few more just like it out there, you know, yeah. so that we can really make it. The King system. Conservation District worked with Pat and Mike Traub to develop a farm plan for their Enumclaw property. One goal, to restore a salmon bearing creek. So I'm really glad you guys left me a, a We place bought this family. place about three years ago and there was nothing but blackberries up and down here. We didn't even know we had a creek here. Our neighbor Bob was telling us about this wonderful farm plan that we need to put together. So we got a hold of King Conservation District and put a farm plan together and then they hooked us up with Debbie because of our stream. We were able to look at savings of salmon and the stream down here by moving our fence line, getting rid of the uh, blackberries. It was really daunting. It was a lot of blackberry where um, she didn't even know if she had a fence or not. So <laughs> Did she know she had a stream? She, she maybe knew she I had a stream. It. She could hear it, but um, the blackberries were acting as the fence for her animals. We knew it was going to be a big job, and uh, we probably spent one whole week of clearing. We worked with a Conservation Corps work crew and spent a week clearing blackberries with mostly um, brush cutters, hand, yeah. hand. Yeah, by hand. You hand dug equipment. out a lot of stuff. And then we dug out all the root balls, yeah. and then we replanted the, the whole area with native plants. These native plants, in addition to providing the diversity for wildlife, uh, for birds and, and mammals. Um, they are also going to provide a lot of habitat for insects, which then the salmon feed on. I tell people all the time how wonderful King Conservation District is. And in fact, I have brochures all the time that I'm giving out to people. You need to do a farm plan. If you live on a stream, you need to get them over here to look at your stream and see if there's something that they can do to help. What we have now is almost like a park. And we come down here and actually have seen hundreds, probably closer to thousands of salmon come up here and spawn, which is just wonderful to be able to have that experience to come down here and see the water and, and know that the salmon are just are, are doing better because we did something that made a difference.